Hmm. Where could Sebastian be? Oh, there he is. Sebastian, I've been trying to find you. Is everything okay? Yeah, everything's fine. Are you sure? It's just, sometimes, Thomas sees the worst in me. They say I'm exactly like the grandfather I was named after, but I'm far from. What was your grandfather like? He was, um, charismatic, charming, unafraid of detentions or breaking the rules. But he also did something completely unforgivable, something I mustn't speak about. Either way, I don't see myself in him, but I'm always reminded of who I'm named after. Why were you named after him? Our mum, she, um, passed away shortly after I was born. Her last wish was that I be named after him. Our mother saw the good in him and wanted his name to live on, but his name just seems to be a curse. Some things I'm now marked with for eternity, if not more. Sebastian. Yes? You're more than what he ever could be. I know that to be sure. Whatever he had done in his past doesn't define you, Sebastian. You are charismatic, charming, and absolutely unafraid of detentions or breaking the rules. I mean, look at us now. But, despite those similarities, you do have with your grandfather. You're kind, loyal, determined, and knows exactly what he wants. And I love that in you, Seb. What are you looking at? Can I kiss you? Seb. Don't say anything. Please. I... I've been wanting to tell you how I've felt about you since the moment before winter break, when we snuck out before sunset and the snow was covering the entire ground and you twirled happily, trying to catch snow on your tongue, but it would hit the tip of your nose instead. The way you smiled, the way you would smile back at me, made me fall even more in, in love with you. I never knew you felt that way about me, Sebastian. Well, I do, and I needed to tell you. I hope you may feel the same way about me. I don't know how I feel, right now. I understand. Oh, look, the sun is going down. Would you mind if I show you something I've been working on? Okay. You have to close your eyes, though. Are they closed? Yes, Sebastian. Open your eyes now. Glowing butterflies. They're beautiful. I worked on this for weeks, just for you. All for me? Yes, they are all for you. I think we better head back up to the school. Looks like it might rain. Yeah, I think you're right. Wait, Amelia? Yes, Sebastian? I need to know. I can't wait any longer. I need to know if you have any feelings for me too, Amelia. I can't go back to my common room thinking about what happened tonight, still not knowing how you truly feel. About me. Well, if you must know, I'm in love with you too, Sebastian. I just didn't think you would be the one to say it. Oh good, I was starting to get worried. I'd like to do something, if you don't mind. What is it? Have you ever been kissed in the rain before? I don't believe I have been kissed in the rain, 
seeing that you were my first kiss. I was truly your first kiss? Yes, you were. Then, I hope to be your last. So, can I have one last kiss with you in the rain? It's kind of cute, but it's 